So, in, in music, here's what I've learned so far. There's, uh, there's sound waves, and some of them enter our heads as either pleasing or displeasing. And generally, music fits into the pleasing category. That's what you would think. You would think that it's musical, it sounds nice, but not all music is appealing. So there's more than just sound waves. There's also the elements of, of uh, traditional society determining factors. But we'll forget those for now. We'll definitely circle back to those into, on, a, on another video. But for now, sound waves bouncing in the atmosphere, hitting our ears and causes vibration in our heads and we either like it or we don't like it. So there's an infinite number of um, waves that can be created and a wave at the end of the day is just something vibrating. It either vibrates very quickly or it vibrates very slowly. Uh, we won't go into those specific technicals in this video but what we will talk about is the frequencies. So we're talking about either things moving very fast or things moving very slow. And the faster it moves, the higher pitched it goes, the slower it moves, the lower the pitches. There's an infinite range. Now, here's the thing. Us humans have decided that we're gonna like categories of 12, 12 notes. That's it. So for example, an A is 400 bounces in a, in a second. Crazy thing is that if you double that, you get 800 frequency, uh, uh, vibrations in a second. That's also an A, it's just an A on a higher octave. The truth is, this is all too technical right now. So we're not gonna, we're not gonna worry about that at all. What we are gonna worry about is what actually sounds nice. Here's a guitar. And that's a note. Don't worry about the technicals. I'm not gonna call out what it is. The fact that it's an E, but anyway. So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna see that there's 12 notes. And the 12th note is somewhat similar. Actually, it's the 13th note because it, it's a higher octave. So th there you go, there's music. We've literally just created our first song. Nothing wrong with calling that a song. Uh, it sounds unappealing. So we do have to, we have to dive deeper. Uh, so anyway, this is what I learned, that there's 12 notes there you go. Uh, the next thing I learned was a bar chord. So if you hold your, your, this finger here and move it along with this finger here. So two strings down and that's it. You got a bar chord in that shape. One finger there on the first string, actually the sixth string is what they call it. First, first string closest to you. And then the next finger, which is uh, two frets down. Each one of these are called a fret on the guitar. Two frets down, and you might as well just hold the third string, actually the fourth string, as well. That's a bar chord. You can literally play every single song in modern society, Western society, with these chords. These bar chords. That's it. You know everything about music.